<clears throat> hey y'all, this is Brandy from Southern Crafts DIY, and I want to say hey to all my returning viewers and welcome to any new viewers. And just a reminder, I'm going to show you everything that we're going to do for this project, and you can get the list for this stuff on social media which the links are down below if you want to follow me you can also get the list on the social the community tab I'm sorry so I'm gonna go ahead and show you everything that's needed you're gonna need a reframe the little one it's a two-pack from Dollar Tree so you're gonna need that you're gonna need some kind of fabric I picked this because I absolutely love Nightmare Before Christmas so you're gonna need that you're gonna need about six popsicle sticks and apparently I only have five of the six so I can't count you're gonna need some of this I got this from I want to say I got it from Michaels but I could have got it from Hobby Lobby it's just some wire floral wire you're gonna need miter shears wire cutters and I'm going to use flex glue, so let's get started. Alright, so the first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be cutting out this ring and then the bottom ring from our wreath. the bigger cutters because I gotta make sure they get in it gets in the hole. So Let's see if we can get this to work. Give me a second y'all. I'm sorry I didn't put it on camera. I didn't have a small enough, a bigger one than this, and a, uh, of wire cutters, and a smaller one than this that would fit in there, so I had to work it, and I finally got it off, it wasn't really that hard to do, and I didn't damage it too much, I didn't damage it, so we're going to go from there. So once you get the two pieces of the frame separate it which I believe the bottom the smallest and the biggest is the ones I used you're gonna move on to glue them together and you're gonna want a bit of a height so I was gonna cut this but I don't think I'm gonna cut it. I think I'm gonna use these just the way they are so Give me a second. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add the glue. It all of a sudden doesn't want to come out. Even though it came out a second ago. I'm sorry y'all. It's being a pain in my... So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this Sorry y'all my And I'm going to hold it up and I'm just going to it's got to sit overnight. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm having technical difficulties here. And you just got to let it sit overnight to dry. 
I'm sorry y'all. I'm gonna finish getting this on there. So this is a lot harder than it looks, y'all. So just bear with me. Like I said, I know this will work once I get it on there, but I got to get it on there first. And of course, I'm going to have technical difficulties, y'all. <laughs> yeah. I know how to fix those technical difficulties. You want it coming off that way. Okay. Whew. I got one more to do. And hopefully this works right. <laughs> is crazy. I know this will work because I've done it before and maybe not this exact thing but the glue so I know it'll work. Okay. Now like I said you just gotta let it sit overnight to glue. When it does what I want it to do. Not what it decides to do. Alright, so just let it sit overnight and then we'll move to the next one. Alright y'all, it should be dry. doing this you also have to be able to attach it to the lamp and I had an idea on how to do that so this was my idea I'm gonna take the um, floral wire like I said to get and I'm going to hook it on there Sorry, I don't have a very good setup right now. That was stupid of me. Hold on, I did it the wrong way. All right, so and hook it on there. One on each side. And I'm not really worried about the fact that I bent the wire because you're going to have to bend it anyway. So, it's not a huge deal. Give me a second. But like I said, one on each side. And then I'm going to wrap it around this just to help hold it in place, y'all. Alright y'all, plan B, that just did not work and I am just fed up with my ideas not working. So, I bought one of these and I'm going to try it with this. Same thing applies, you're going to want to attach this on there so that it will hold it up. I'm sorry y'all, I am really disappointed in how this worked out, but I am going to get it done.
There we go. And I'm doing it like this because I want to make sure it is nice and stable. Because this is going to be what I'm using to hold it on there. Okay. So I'm going to do that with the other one. So give me a second and I'll show you. As you can see, I looped it around here. I looped it a little bit better, but I looped it around here. And then I I pulled it through here and lifted it around there just to give it a thing. Now I'm gonna leave that alone for now and I'm gonna move on to the next step. I am so sorry y'all. I really wanted to do this different, but if it's not gonna work with me, I will find a way to make it work. Don't think I won't. So now I'm gonna take my fabric and I want to check it out how I'm going to do this. Sorry, y'all. As you can see, it's plenty long enough. So. Sorry, um, I've never done this before, so I'm just guessing how to do this. So, if y'all know a better way, I would love to hear it. But. I'm just going around and I'm marking where it needs to be cut out so give me a second now either this works or I give up because I'm having way too many problems with this and I wanted something that y'all would like but I don't even know anymore so like I said either this works or it doesn't so I'm just gonna show you all how to do it you might want to use different glue I don't know I'm using the glue I have and I'm going to go from there, so I'm going to try this liquid adhesive glue. I don't know. I'm get it out. I don't think that's going to work. Alright, I will figure it out. I might just use hot glue to show y'all how it's done because I want this done so y'all can see. So I'm going to get the glue off. This is just not coming out the way I want it to, y'all. I'm so sorry. I'll try this one more time and if it does not work, then I officially give up on making the uh, I forgot what it's called. Lampshade, because I've had nothing but problems, y'all. And I really wanted to show y'all this. Because I really like this idea. Now, I would normally cut it to fit, but I'm having problems. So I don't want to go too far until I get it completely done. So.
That is why I am doing it this way. Now, I really, really did want to make my own frame, but it just was not working. It probably would work better if I had more tools that I have, but I'm just going to be happy, be happy with what I have and go from there. I just I could but I don't have the stuff to trim it right to make it look better on the inside so I'm just going to you know people aren't gonna see the inside anyways you know so I'm just trying to make it look as good as I can I'm probably am gonna trim this stuff because that's getting a little long but let me Do this to the best of my ability, y'all. Just a little. Okay. Now, I'm going to continue gluing. I gotta cut the top too, so don't worry about it. I'm hoping this comes out the way I want it to look, but truth be, truth be told, I'll be happy with it no matter what because I've done the best I can with what I have, so I have to, I'm not perfect. I don't really use fabric that much like this, but it was an idea 
and I really did want to make a lampshade that I liked. So. scissors y'all and I'll probably trim this up more after it dries but you know you gotta do what you gotta do Don't worry about these scrap pieces. I will find something to use them for. I'm not going to waste my pieces of fabric. So, I will figure out something to use them for. Okay. Like I said, this isn't exactly the idea I had, but it'll work, I guess. keep going. I hope this is in view good enough. You're just going to keep gluing it. And truth be told, I would have preferred a different glue, but this is the glue I have. So, this is the glue I'm working with. See if I can get this good. I'm gonna have to glue down there a little, I think. You're gonna take and cut where you don't need it no more. And if you have to add a little bit more glue just to make it hold down better, then that's what you do. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to, wherever I cut that's loose, I'm going to add more glue. I'm going to do that. Alright. So, and then I'm going to this down in here and then I'm gonna cut the top I'm trying to be careful when I do it And you want to have a little bit of an overhang because you're going to need to glue it down up top too. So that is my next step. I might have got a little bit more in some spots, so I'm going to trim it. I'm nowhere near perfect at this, but I'm going to try to make it look as nice as I can. 
when I'm done. And like I said, you're just going to go around and you're going to now glue your top edge down. And I don't think I got it tight enough, but this should work fine. It should be fine. And there is the um, lampshade. Let me fix this up a little. Okay. So there is the lampshade. So the next thing you're going to do, and let me see if I can get it where you can see it, is you're going to come over here and you're going to take it. And you're going to figure out how long you need it to be. I'm sorry, y'all. I think... I'll turn this off and get it out of the way. I think right here will be good. And you're going to need to make hooks. And I had already put a little... Give me a second, y'all. I had already put a little loop on here. I'm hoping this works, y'all. I really do. This was the only thing I could think of. Oh, I think I made this too short. Sheet. Give me a second, y'all. If I could do it now. I'm sorry, y'all. I just... Sometimes, what I think I can do doesn't work out the way I think it will, so... Now this was just an idea I had. I'm not even sure it's going to work right, but I'm hoping it will. Alright, so. Oops. Give me a second. <sighs> Y'all, this is frustrating when I think of something and it doesn't want to do what I want it to do, you know? Just do this. Because I'm going to trim it once I figure out how long it needs to be, you know? Because you don't want it too long. I might have to do more 
wires. But let me get this the way I want it. I might not need more wires. I might just need to get this the way I want it. And it might work out just fine. being crazy and doing what it wants not what I want it to do there we go and we're gonna turn this and then we're gonna fix the middle and it should be fine going to add more to it just to help it stay but look at that it's a little big but it's okay I couldn't find anything smaller that would work so I'm happy with it I'm just gonna have to add a few more of the wires to this side and it'll it should balance out as you can see it is a little big but I used what I was working with and I think it came out looking good despite the fact that I had problems with it. I added a few more of these on there to make it more even. I'm happy with it. I hope y'all like it, but the project is done. And if you liked it, please, please, please like, share, subscribe, and comment because it does help my channel grow and it lets me know that y'all liked it. Alright, I'll see y'all next time. Bye!